out, out of who, all the people you've managed to talk to in the past, I mean, we've known each other over 10 years at yeah. this point. Yeah. <laughs> who, who are you so happy that you got to meet, that you got to swap a few words with? Oh, goodness. That's, uh. I'm not asking you to name one person, but just, just to, right. to pick a name. It doesn't have to be the top name. Well, um, pretty early on in my, uh, in my uh, attending Comic-Cons, in fact, I think it was one of my first big conventions that I got to go to in Baltimore. Uh, my favorite comic artist, Stuart, Amo- Stuart Amonin, him and his wife were there. And so I, I got to chat with him for a little bit, and it was just amazing to see him and his art and stuff there. Um, uh, I've gotten to meet a lot of really unique uh, comic artists. Uh, gosh, I got to meet Darwin Cook before he passed away. Um, super, super down to earth guy. Um, <clears throat> oh, I'll tell you what, one of, um, I got to meet a few editors and art directors at like DC and Marvel. Mm-hmm. Uh, I had a really great portfolio critique from one of the senior editors at Marvel, Nick Lowe, and he was just a real cool guy and, and, and was, and he was, he knew how to give a critique. It was a very, uh, honest yet, uh, gentle and, uh, caring critique if that mm-hmm. makes sense I think a lot of people don't know how to give a proper critique and mm-hmm. and Nick uh, did know how to do that and, and uh, so he shared a lot of really great pointers with me uh, about what Marvel specifically was looking for in their comic work and so that was really amazing 